Jiffer and James Prince Sr. I mean, I don't, I wouldn't have no information other than just we helping with a Larry Hoover project. Hey, the feds just called my phone mm -hmm. two hours ago. What they say? Mm. On Paul, I recorded oh, all that. So they be on here listening. Yeah, they're using that. Yeah, Yo, Phoenix, where you at? You on here? Hold on, one mic on whack. What happened, whack? The fans just called my phone two hours ago. What they were talking about? I seen this shit, right? So first, you know, I've been trying to get game passport cleared. I said, maybe it's the, you know, the passport people, right? Uh-huh. So I said, I ain't going to answer. Let me put the recorder on then call. I called back. Niggas, straight fans. So... They asked me, have I been threatened? I said, what? What are you talking about? They talking about the boy, right? So that let me know they on his line. They didn't hear something. Right? I do what a real nigga's supposed to do and clean it all the way up, like the best of friends, whatever, you know, no issues. We ain't, they pressing. Mm -hmm. What about the late? Nah, never. It's just negotiations going on with the attorney. I don't know where you're getting this from. And blase, blase. But it's let me know. They didn't hear something on that man line on, on his line over there. Mm. I kept it one hundred. I kept it all the way solid. Actually, YG, I'm finna send it to you so you can hear. Houston, it's Texas. Yeah, you know, yeah YG. I just they got him on the line. The He's whole... talking. No, he talking. He definitely. Talking. They had him on the line. I did, nigga. I... Phoenix, you got a thing? Yep, I just got it. You got it. I'm on mute because I'm at the arcade, but I'm oh, listening. Who got it? Who got the thing? Play that. You want me to play it? Play it. You right. niggas need to know how to deal with this case in that situation. Play that. Play that. Hold on. Everybody meet it's up. That's how y'all deal with this. Y'all know me and this nigga don't see eye to eye, but you got to, now I see how niggas get caught up. Jeffrey and James Prince Sr. I mean, I don't, I wouldn't have no information other than just we helping with a Larry Hoover project. Hey, the feds just called my phone two hours ago. What they saying? Yeah, they're using that for the Larry Hoover project. Okay, yes, sir. No, sir. I, no, nothing's nothing's wrong whatsoever with it. Uh, I'm I'm glad someone is is advocating for him. That that wasn't the issue. Um, I was just um, information has pro been provided that you had some disagreements with Mr. Prince. Are you familiar with him? Uh, I mean, I know who he is, but I don't have no issues with Mr. Prince. Okay, so. Um, I mean, a disagreement is a disagreement. I don't know how that factors in the FBI. Well, I, I think Mr. Mr. Jones, uh, uh, off of YouTube videos going back and forth with him calling you a snitch and you calling him one, and 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 all of and, and all of that would, okay. would be where we received information that there was possibly a disagreement. Yeah, well, uh, even if we did do that, why would why would that be an uh, interest of the FBI? Because these well, one of us have any barren cases pending against one another. We have never done any business with one another. As uh, far as I know, Mr. Prince um, uh, is a business manager, and I am. So in regards to what we say to each other, um, as far as the snitch and not being the snitch, like, why would that be uh, interest of the FBI? That's what's kind of confusing to me. Okay, no, I can, and I can, I can explain that. I mean, of course, there's nothing wrong wrong with that whatsoever um uh, we're just making sure that uh no threats have been made to you from anyone uh associated with him over over y'all's dispute no i haven't uh no threats have been made uh, nor do i feel threatened uh you know two men get angry two men say things uh, we've both been in each other's presence uh, from time to time um, I know his, I know his children, uh, nah, not at all. I don't feel a threat. Was it something you, you guys know that I don't know? Cause, oh, well, yeah, I'm concerned. It's just, you know, the, the daily bullshit propaganda that happens on social media. Oh, yes, sir. I understand that. But you, but I think you could, uh, kind of understand that sometimes things go past social media and, um, we were providing information that possibly, possibly that something went beyond that. And so we're just calling to clarify and make sure that you haven't been threatened or, or anyone that you know that have been threatened by him or his associates regarding 
the disputes that you've had over social media, over YouTube, over Instagram, and, and all of that? No, Mr. Prince has an issue. Any press towards me, um, I don't feel threatened. Um, uh, I've said to him the same things he said to me, and that's just two men saying things. Uh, I don't think it's that serious of a situation. As far as I know, Mr. Prince has uh, continued his business. He's built in his community, as I am. I don't even understand. Like I said, I don't know what you guys have going on or what you guys heard. That's above my, you know, my reach. But he personally, no, I haven't got any threats, nor do I feel threatened by the man. Okay, so are y'all working together on the Free Larry Hoover project? Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. It's not my ownership of the project is not mine. It belongs to somebody else. I'm okay. just assisting that individual. No, uh, but I did. I did put the uh, attorneys in contact with their with their family attorney. So at this point, uh, it's not even a conversation between me and Jay Prince is a conversation between the individual who owns the content on my side, attorney, and their, uh, the Hoover family attorney. So it's, you know, for the last month or so, you haven't heard uh, me and Mr. Prince uh, say really anything to each other because there's no need to. Okay, understandable. Mr. Jones, was there ever, I know there was a, um, I don't know. She did she record an interview? I, I don't have her name uh, present, but she's out of LA, um, and, and she recorded a video with Mr. Hoover at one time. Are you are you familiar with that? Uh, somebody recording a video with Mr. Hoover? Or an interview? She conducted an interview. Oh well, yeah, we have five hours of interview. Yes, sir. And yes, at any yes. point. Okay, and it was a female, correct? I don't have her name with me at this exact moment. It's an um, it's a, it's a elderly woman that owns it. Yes, yes, sir. And, and let me ask you this. Have, have you ever heard of any information that uh, Mr. Prince or his associates has, um, has tried to request that information, the, the video from her? Oh, no. And well, I, was in a, I, I mean, I'm the one that alerted him that the uh, footage was was real and tried to merge a deal um, with them because they own the night rights. This is the rights of a regular uh, documentary that was recorded while he was in prison. So um, I just tried to bring the two parties together um, to see if they can do one, do a, make it one big situation. Uh, yes, sir. And so who owns the rights to that, to that the, 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 the lady that Maybe you have the footage. She has the contract. I have the contract. I forward the contracts to the family attorneys. Um, um, she's, she's, she's been on here since 1998. Yes, sir. And did Mr. Prince attempt to get the rights to that interview? Uh, no, he attempted to negotiate a deal if possible. And the negotiations are still going on. But okay. I mean, that's his business. There's nothing wrong with him negotiating. Oh, absolutely not. I'm, I'm not implying that whatsoever. Just some information that we received was that um, that uh, the, the documentary, the, the businesswoman didn't want to really give up the documentary and uh, possibly could have been pressured to do so. No, I don't, I don't know anything about her being pressured. Um, she had a conversation on my phone. It was just a simple business conversation. Uh, when you do a business, there's always offer. You know, either you're going to accept the offer or you're going to continue to negotiate. So as of right now, we're still negotiating. She's she negotiating. It's just the two attorneys are talking and they're figuring it out. Other okay. than that, it's, it's, um, you know, uh, Mr. Uh, Prince has been a close friend to uh, the Hoover family. He's done a lot of business, overseen a lot of business. So the man is well in his right to attempt to negotiate. But that's all it was, was negotiations. No more, no less. Okay. Well, I I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for talking to me. Um, if you want to keep my number and anything uh, comes up or you, or you hear of anything dealing with any type of threat or 
Yo. Wow. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah.